So what is it like actually being a general contractor? Well, if you're thinking about becoming a general contractor in the future, watch out for helicopters and when you're making videos. Well, I've been a general contractor for the last six years or so, and I've learned a lot. I've learned that it's not just hiring subcontractors, putting markup on it, and letting them go to the job and pray to God nothing bad happens. It's understanding every division of construction, understanding the site work, what goes into that, the utilities, the roughing, the concrete, the framing, the MEP, the mechanical, electrical, plumbing. And not just saying, yeah, I understand it, saying, no, what about the mechanical systems, the inner workings and the supplies and the returns, the CFMs, the specific types of duct work, the makeup air, the fresh air returns, everything that goes into, that's just HVAC, and it goes so deep. And plumbing goes so deep, and electrical goes so deep, the, so deep, the knowledge behind all of these different trades, and it's that's what you are, is you're the general contractor. So you understand, you need to understand the entire project and put the whole package together for the client. So it's client, you as a general contractor, then all of your subcontractors that are working underneath you. Now, the aspect of this is you also, as the general contractor, more than likely would be the business owner. There's a difference between, say, just a business owner as an electrical contractor or a business owner as an HVAC contractor because you're also running the business, so you're doing your 941s and your 944s and your RT6s and the payments and all kinds of stuff and paying payroll and doing everything that the business owner needs to take care of, but you're also understanding and knowing about the electrical contractor stuff or the HVAC contractor stuff, but as the general contractor, you need to understand it all. So it's been interesting you know, a guy um, like myself who decided to start his own company and picked <laughs> a very hard industry. First of all, construction, an extremely very hard industry. There's a lot of heartache, a lot of headache, and a lot of problems that it's what we do as a contractor or in the construction industry is solve problems. So that's what you need to learn is that this is not gonna be easy. There's gonna be problems to solve and you need to understand it all. Now, I wouldn't say for you to get started don't do a, any steps forward until you understand everything, because that's impossible. You can't understand more and more about your job until you actually start working in the field. The first thing you need to do is gain experience. So a lot of people, you guys come to me like on Instagram and you DM me and you're like, what do I do? I wanna be a general contractor. I have no experience. First thing I say, please get experience. They're probably you know, nailing some pylons into the ground right now on this site. Long story short, reach out to me if you have any questions. Check out jessielaneconsulting.com, which is a new website I just built. You can schedule a phone call with me. You can watch uh, a couple of videos. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be updating it as, as things progress. There's like an estimating template spreadsheet on there. But anyway, like this video, ask any question that you like. There's a lot more coming up. And um, this is brief, but I'll see you in the next vlog. Thanks for watching. Let's see what it looks like. Maybe the shade. B-roll with Jesse's audio in the background.